Now the parents of an 18 month old boy who claimed their son was duct taped to his sleeping mat at a daycare last June are suing the daycare. The facility is also under investigation by the state. Of course, Phil Alvarado has got more on that lawsuit the parents filed today. Phil, what are they alleging? Well, Clarice, it's uh, important to know that uh, the uh, daycare remains open for business right now. Uh, the main allegations are that one person did use duct tape to uh, keep this toddler still during nap time, but there are other allegations that the water breaks were limited in order to cut down on diaper changes. I think it's heartbreaking. I think it's a mother's worst nightmare. The nightmare for Christy Galbraith are the images of her 18-month-old son duct taped to his sleeping mat at his daycare. A lawsuit by the parents says the photos were taken by a former teacher at the Heart to Heart Montessori Academy daycare in Willow Park, just west of Fort Worth. He would fight his tooth and nail to go into the classroom, which was um, very unusual for him. In the lawsuit, the parents and their attorney say the former teacher alerted Christy Galbraith to what she saw and photographed. And when she confronted a co-worker she believed was responsible, she was told by the daycare not to talk about it to anyone. Diaper changings all of a sudden became just a, a traumatic event. As the parents learned more about the allegations, changes in their son's behavior seemed to fall into place. He started uh, just screaming terribly when you'd go to change his diapers and then he would start uh, hitting himself in the head. The suit alleges children were sometimes slapped in the head during a diaper change if they soiled their diaper. The suit also says the daycare only allowed children to drink twice a day to cut down on diaper changes. He was very, very thirsty when we'd pick him up every day, uh, overly so. And he would always demand fluids, water, uh, when he would go to take a nap. The lawsuit says one other boy and a girl on a separate occasion were duct taped to their mats during naps. The suit says one of the owners of the Heart to Heart daycare said at a meeting with other parents the duct tape incident had never happened before. Christy Galbraith says her advice is for parents to make frequent visits to their daycare. And you watch your kid and you see how they're doing and you see how they are when you drop them off and you notice how they are when you pick them up and you ask them questions and you listen. Now, the Texas Department of Family and Protective Services is also investigating. Uh, the parents are suing for an undisclosed amount of money, but their attorney says this is not about the money. It's about uh, trying to prevent this from ever happening again. And they, they are glad that the cameras have now been installed and there are frequent water breaks. Uh, the attorney for the daycare says she can't comment on the lawsuit except to say that the person who's alleged to have used the duct tape is no longer at the daycare. Clarice? All right, Phil. Thank you.